Good morning. Since I'm in the mood to cook this morning. Believe it or not, I can actually cook. Yes, I can cook. It's not just about snacks, <laughs> even though snacks are life. Okay, so we tried the just, uh, just egg. I tried to make an omelet. I put too much. I like a lot of onions and stuff in my, and spices and stuff in it. I put uh, tomatoes and stuff in it. Tomatoes, um, they call them wild onions, but green onions, um, white onion or yellow. I think that was white, though. White onion and also red onion because red, on, you know, red onion is actually the healthiest onion, so I try to use that one a little bit more. But I do like that with uh, the red onion with the white onion or the yellow onion. But it has all those in that, some rosemary, parsley, some little spices. I think the tomatoes, see, normally I use like the Rotel uh, already kind of pre-minced tomatoes for the omelets and stuff like that. But I had a lot of tomatoes left over and, you know, I kind of overbought on produce <laughs> uh, last week or week before last. So I'm trying to use that up. So I use one whole uh, small, small, I think aroma tomato. For that, so I think it was just too heavy. But other than that, it cooks just like eggs, and I kind of like really like it. <laughs> I'm gonna taste it in just a second, but yeah, it was um, it started to form like an onion. I mean, an omelet, but like I think it was just too much of the bell pepper, onions, and stuff like that. And so next time I use less of that, and I think the tomatoes is what made it a little too heavy to flip. Other than that, it almost flipped pretty decent, like a regular egg. But you know. It's a fail. We'll try later again this week. <laughs> also, last night I made some kale. Like I said, I overbought on produce last week, so I'm trying to use all the kale. That's organic kale. It was 99 cent at Kroger's. <laughs> I was not going to let that go to waste. No, I was not. So we have this one. I'm going to make it again probably because I actually like kale. I forgot to get spinach. I normally mix both of those together. Uh, but kale, saute kale with like onions and bell pepper and a little like little seasonings and stuff like that. Not, not a lot in kale, even though it's really bitter. I try to use peppers and stuff like that to kind of combat the bitterness. And then these are the Morning Star breakfast patties. I kind of like them. I didn't at first. I, I like their uh, sausages more than the patty. But the patties, they, they, they like I said, they cook just like regular sausage. You don't, you don't even know. So I do kind of like mine on the crispier end, sort of-ish, to make them kind of bounce back like meat. I know some people like them lighter. Sometimes I like them lighter, too. It just depends on... You know how I like them, but today I said, you know, I want them crispy, crispy. I wanted to, I forgot to actually buy the bacon that they have. I think them, Boca, and somebody else makes like the little breakfast, vegan breakfast bacon or whatever. But honey, we're going to roll with this right here. <laughs> so we have sauteed kale. We have the scrambled just egg eggs. And then we have, uh, which is like the omelet almost fail-ish, a little something, something, something. It looks just like eggs. And then you have the Morningstar um, breakfast patty. And, like, all this is, like, plant-based, you know, vegan, vegetarian, whatever you want to call it, meat-free type of situation. So, this is my breakfast. This is what I eat sometimes. And I'm not a breakfast person, so, but today I was hungry. <laughs> and I felt like cooking because that's actually one of my favorite pastimes is what? Cooking. Because who doesn't love food? Okay, so the Just Egg, uh, let me see. Let me see. What, is it, what does it taste like? See, that's what it looks like. It, it started to form into the... It was just too heavy. And that's my own fault because I added too many... Uh, see, I, I'm extra, even with food. Mm, it tastes just like eggs. <laughs> so it does taste like eggs. So I like it. I just won't add um, as um, as much ingredients with it. But, you know, I, I like food food with my food. And that's how I would make my eggs with my omelet. With a little bit of... Um, extra ingredients brother so next next time i'll just kind of cut back on the tomatoes and all that kind of stuff but other than that it's like really good like the kale really good and i got this at kroger's like i said 90, you can all every other week they have it on sale like 99 cents like a bunch so it's sauteed kale i use a little bit too much oil in it just a little bit but honey it's, it's just oh well it's light oil in a way and then the Morning Star patties, they're always on sale, $3.99. And they, at Kroger's, I get the best ones at Kroger's. Walmart carries it and stuff as well, but I, I don't go to Walmart as much. I go to Kroger's and some other, like Aldi's and stuff like that. And Aldi's has their own line as well, but I hadn't tried their, their direct line just yet for vegan and vegetarian peoples. So this is it. This is my breakfast. Scrambled eggs, sauteed kale, and vegan breakfast patty, meat-free breakfast patties. This is it. Happy Saturday.